how that's and that's so you were in the pattern. It's not a pattern. It's not healthy. Right. But here's what I want you to get. The trust has to be of yourself. What's up, peoples? It's Rasta Boy TV, and you know it's your boy, the real Rasta Boy. Y'all can find me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook all at the damn same time. Yes, I'm here watching Ayala Fix My Life, this three part episode of Fix My Father with 34 children. Oh, God. I needed me a cocktail for this one because, child, this is some messy boots with this man, Jay. With one of them, I'm sipping on, I'm sipping on some mango rita, you know, the lime marita. I'm drinking on the mango flavor with a splash of um, orange mango, um, sunny delight, and a shot of vodka. I needed something strong tonight for this episode. If you have not yet seen the three part episode of Ayala Fix My Life, Fix My father with 34 children you need to subscribe to own tv because i'm sure maybe you can't find it online because own is one of them channels that don't even let you um watch it online this is very deep imagine somebody with 34 children with 17 baby mother he has never even married any of these ladies so for people out there who are you know I'm appalled. I was very appalled watching this tonight. I know my father had me, one, two, two, three, four, five, five kids with three different maybe, three, one, two, three, four, four different maybe mother and two wives. My mom, my, my brother and I are the same age, months apart. My sister's older than me. That's three of us. He had a child that was younger than me. And then when he got remarried, he got another daughter. So, I know it's messy out there when people have several different baby mamas. And the father is just keep on going around having multiple children with different baby mama. But when it's 17 people and it's 34 children. And possibly there could be other children out there that he possibly don't know about. Because this man said that if he wasn't using contraceptive, a.k.a. condoms... He possibly would have many more children out there. Thirty four children to me is a lot. You know, you know of you know where elderly grandmothers and great grandmothers have like 10, 12 children back in the old days. But you know, that was kinda of like the norm or something back for, for those people back in those days. Grand great grandmothers and whatever and the Puerto Ricans and stuff like that. They have kids that, you know, are, you know, in a good amount of quantity quantity. But when you talk about 34, I'm like, he was just going around and splashing off in all these girls, these good-for-nothing ladies who don't want nothing better. Some of these kids were actually same age. I'm like, same age. I mean, that all these girls were pregnant at the same time. Even what was so nasty about it and so devastating to know about it, what, two of the baby mamas, they're actually friends. One was with one was been with him or one is with him for years over 14 years and she said that the friend kind of pushed herself way in on the relationship with him and he tried to mess with her to see that she would take the bait she took the bait not only that she had only one child for him she had three children for that one person how can you have three children for one person when you know that your friend's baby father or your friend's man so messy and then these ladies are so caught up in, and infatuated by the fact that what is a smooth talker he says gonna do this and do that for you but then he doesn't fulfill all these obligations they say he's gonna do and then y'all still take him back y'all still lay up with him y'all seem like y'all know about the fact that you know y'all may not know of each other but y'all know this man has multiple children is it is it the sex that good i would like y'all for y'all to take ayala's um advice and get a bob a battery operated boyfriend because child y'all need to play with y'all own selves and start letting this man put his penis up inside of y'all and splashing off raw dog in y'all giving y'all these babies first of all there's there's he's not even a millionaire or like i'm not even gonna go that way route because it's not about the money sometimes he needs to be there individually for 
all these children and he cannot be in 34 places at 34 different times there's no way possible yes some of the baby mamas have more than one children one has i think one had four one had three and they were all different ages i'm like some of them were like 11 7 you know four and two and one was like five and seven like all these people that he, he had like a child at least one child per year um you know during all those time like he had like you know one child last year one a year before one a year before one a year before one a year before or multiple children in the same year i'm like these people are either caught up with the fact that somebody's lying to them or they just they just don't care how can you let somebody who you know made a mistake with maybe one time okay he's telling me all these lies about how he's gonna do better and we had the first child okay he's not doing any better why keep on open up your legs to this man that cannot give you any better and have another baby with him and then still hear rumors around the town and city about the fact that jay has multiple children over 10 children and y'all still lay down with this man i think for some reason that you all y'all women out there you know y'all are easily persuaded and to me i don't know if y'all just know one better he's what 44 45 years old and 34 children 34 children and who to tell this may not stop at the end of the day is he don't he don't care in my opinion he think that for some reason that because of how he was brought up with his father and his mother in a broken relationship relationship when he was growing up this is what affected him it possibly may, possible may have affected him in my opinion based on the fact that when he was growing up you know is is his, his mother abandoned him then his father abandoned him then he was in you know you know i think what foster care that ch ch group home whatever you want to call it and so forth you know and so you know he was left to fend for himself and then you know i i don't know he's not that hot so i don't know what woman was throwing that thrown you know throw that pussy up on i'm not i, I don't want to curse but i don't know what woman was was so infatuated by this one man that 17 of y'all, first of all, he's not no damn entertainer that is, you know, making it rain on y'all and making it rain in, in a lot of big way. He's a, um, a, it seems like he's a videographer. He's like, seems like he does a lot of, um, music videos or stuff like that. He's like, he does a lot of big things in there and there in Atlanta. Y'all know Atlanta is very hot. Y'all don't ever get it popping. So I don't know if, it, if, if that's the reason why, um, you know the women's the women down there you know we know that they say in Atlanta the the population for women to men ratio is very um you know bad so I'm not sure if that's the reason why um y'all just take whatever dick y'all can take down there and don't care if the dick um from the person has multiple children with other females especially when he's sleeping with y'all without any condoms because if, the, if that's the case and he's still with y'all without all condoms y'all can possibly have a lot of stds and you know hiv and all that good stuff and and who to tell you know what he may have given to y'all and y'all didn't know and y'all are some black strong woman out there i'm not sure how the god ever earth that y'all you know let this solution happen to y'all more than one time i don't know i don't know okay one is not a, you can nobody's a mistake no children is a mistake okay it happened accidentally yes but when y'all have two, one two three multiple children with the same person that has multiple children with other females and then sometimes with your friends that is just so gross and nasty i don't know how he did I don't know, well he know how he did it raw dogging up in them and i don't know how they want this man and think that's this man's gonna give them any kind of better Ayana, <laughs> these women, I don't know. I don't know if this is, is, is mothers there trying to, you know, be a better grandmother to these children, grandchildren of hers, um, because obviously, you know, she was broken um, earlier with her, his father, you know, leaving her and whatever. So it's, it seemed like the apple didn't fall far from the tree. But I don't know. It was really t heart wrenching tonight to watch this three part episode of well, it didn't come all in three parts, but I did watch all two parts, including the last finale part came on tonight of Ayala Fix My Life, Fix My Father, thirty four. What do you call it? Fix My Father, 
um, with 34 children. It's very sad. Sorry. It's very sad. But if you have not yet catch it, please go ahead and subscribe to um, Own TV with your cable provider and check it out because this is really a must-see. Make sure y'all leave y'all comments. Leave y'all comments and let me all know how you all feel about this person, Jay, from Atlanta, wherever it's from in Georgia, having 34 kids with 17 different females. Whew. Anyway, I need a little sip of my cocktail. I'm drinking some lime, some lamarita mango flavor, vodka, and a splash of um, orange mango, sunny delight. Y'all enjoy the rest of y'all night, and I'll catch y'all another time here on Rasta Boy TV. Good night. Peace.